What's going on guys, um, it's Gross here and in today's video I'm going to show you all the best settings that you need to change for uh, better performance. Uh, first, we're gonna make sure that uh, game mode is on. Uh, this feature is designed to prevent frame rate drops by stopping background activities like uh, notifications, updates and other background activities from happening while uh, playing games. Uh, it does all that automatically as soon as you have it enabled so yeah keep it enabled uh second we're going to power settings we're gonna hit edit power plan change advanced power settings and you make sure you have this on high performance okay this is uh very 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 important what this do is to make sure your wi-fi your disk drive all that stuff does not go into power saving mode uh, once we do that, we go back and we hit uh, PCI Express, then again here link state power management and we make sure this is on off. After that we go down here and we make sure minimum and maximum processor state are both on 100%. After that we are going to type um, background apps. Um, make sure this is off. Okay, this is going to let apps run in the background and you don't want that, so yeah, turn it off. Uh, next, we're going to mouse settings. Click additional mouse options. Then we're gonna go to power. No, pointer options, sorry, my bad. Uh, make sure enhanced pointer precision is off, please. This is also extremely important you don't want that on okay uh, that's good for typing uh, doing emails but for gaming it's terrible so yeah turn it off um, next we're going to nvidia settings uh, just image settings with preview use the advanced 3d image settings take it there uh, here I copied uh, tense settings, so pretty good. Also, the most of the pros are using them. Um, so yeah, you can just copy this. So on low latency mode, here is the tricky part. Uh, if you have low tier PC, this need to be off. If you have mid tier PC, need to be on and you have a uh, god tier pc you need it on ultra okay i'm gonna just scroll down so you can see also uh here power management mode make sure prefer maximum performance here preferred refresh rate has available very important and yeah so basically when we're done with that we go to adjust desktop core settings um, here usually if you never touch this panel you have 50 50 1 50 0 so <laughs> this is personal preference like i have both on 60 because i like how it looks uh digital vibrance this is something that most pros that play valorant and apex have on like 70 80 90 100 i personally like it on 60 percent uh okay when we're done with that, we're going to Paladins. Uh, use the D, D3, D11 is enabled. Uh, native resolution, full screen, resolution scale. I usually, when I used to have a potato laptop, it was 80, 85, 90. Now I have it on 100. It doesn't do uh, much difference, to be honest. Uh, we have anti aliasing on off, vertical sync disabled, all settings on low, gamma personal preference, FOV, FOV of course uh, personal preference, most of the people have it on 120, you can have it lower if you want, it doesn't really matter. Um, here on south settings, the only important thing is that you need uh, character music volume off. Uh, here, let's see what is important so auto purchase terrible disabled retycle boom disabled <clears throat> retycle change over target personal preference i have it disabled 
um, let's see toggle zoom disabled and this is personal preference of course uh, please show counter and team health bar and show card cooldown spot enabled very important especially if you're a healer um, here sensitivity against personal preference and yeah this is pretty much it um, if you enjoyed this video hit the like share if you want yeah thank you for watching bye